we can't do chess analysis without Karen. But I can't get the next game loaded up. Uh, let's see. Von Forest, Iragasi, Gukesh, Maksudlu. Those are terrible. I don't even want to look at those games. They're so bad. We'll look at Gukesh, Maksudlu, but just the end. Where, where it's like Blunder City. Where it's like, I blunder, you blunder, I blunder, you blunder, I blunder. And then they both resign. Yesterday, all my blunders seem so far away. Yeah, we'll start here. Yeah. This is a good starting point. Okay, so the, the other two games that were decisive in the Masters were very badly played games. So I wanted to jump into some position where, you know, it's sort of funny. <clears throat> oh, okay. Okay. So this is this is the game Gukesh Magsudlu. And as you all know, Magsudlu took over at the last minute for Duda, who withdrew about 10 days before the tournament started. Okay, in this position, Black has one move that doesn't lose. And Black played the opening and middle game quite badly and was in trouble. And now, he, now he's not. So he played knight c3, forking the queen and rook. And now white only has one move that doesn't lose. Queen b6, attacking this rook. Okay, and then he took the rook. And then he took this rook. And in this position, black played the best move. Queen e1 check. Because, you know, f2 is hanging. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you have to play king h2. King, King G2 would be triple question mark. Yeah. Because you take check and you take check and so forth. Yeah. So King H2, put it in H. Okay. Then Queen takes F2 check. Bishop G2, obviously. Okay, now your knight's hanging. So played Rook takes D4, defending his knight and winning a pawn. And possibly he'll take this knight. Queen takes B7. Rook takes c4, rook takes d1, and rook to c2. So we're threatening mate. The only defense is to play rook g1. Okay, and in this position, uh, black played knight d4, which is, which is fine. And white played the best move. Um, it looks like White's in a lot of trouble here, but he unpinned his bishop uh, and stopped knight f3 check. If it's Black's turn to move, knight f3 check wins the game. Because if you play queen takes, I take it. And otherwise, queen takes rook as mate. Thanks, Latin and Blonde, for the subscription. So you play king h1, the only move. And now the position should be a draw. Although it's scary to have White, but okay, this is a good counterplay. Okay, knight f5, that's a reasonable move. Now white only has one move that doesn't lose, and he found it. Queen b8 check. Excellent move. Now in this position, you can play king g7 or king h7. Makes more sense to play king g7 because the bishop's on a white square. So putting your king on a white square is risky. For example, if I play g4 and you blunder knight here check, I take it. Damn. And then when you take back, bishop e4 check, and I take your queen. And I win. So he played the better, king g7. Okay. And this is the time control. So now uh, white should have thought for like five hours and played the only move that draws. Instead, he moved relatively quickly and played a move that loses. Okay. The only move that draws is g4. Was he in time travel? No, this is this is time. This is it. This is forty one. Uh, oh, he just okay. got a time travel. That. Yeah, I was looking over here on the left. And I was confused because yeah. it said thirty nine yeah. seconds. Right. So he he should play g four, and that's the only move that draws. Mm -hmm. Okay. Instead, he played a six, which loses. Knight takes. He played rook a two, which is a mistake. Knight takes g three. Check wins. After king h two, the way to win is very funny. You play knight back to f five. Okay, and now if the guy gets the counterplay that looks pretty good, a pretty good counterplay, I play rook a2, queening gets checkmated because I take it. You can't take with the bishop because it's pinned, so you take with the queen. 
And now you get smothered mated. Check, 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 and mate. Wow. Okay. So cool. so so white can't play a7, a8 queen, mm -hmm. and the engine says black should be winning after knight here, and then play rook a2. Instead, he didn't do that. He didn't he didn't play knight takes g3. He played rook a2, which is a mistake. Now, once again, white only has one move that that doesn't lose, and he blundered. He played queen e5 check. Once again, g4 is a is a draw. Okay. Right. And now black made a 37 question mark move. Yeah. Yeah, he made the worst move ever. And after his move, he's losing. It's hard to believe Black's losing because Black's crushing him. He played King G6, double question mark. Horrible blunder. And in this position, you, you can no longer play Knight G3 because of that line that I showed you with Queen G3 and Bishop E4. And now in that position, if it was Black's turn to move and he could cheat, you could play knight g3, queen g3, queen g3, bishop e4, f5, attacking the bishop. But white plays g4, and this is when Maksudlu realized he can't play knight g3 check. So now he had his head in his hands and he was like crying. Because he was winning, he was trying to win, and now he's lost. And he saw g4, he just probably didn't see after knight g3, you just take it. Right. And then takes bishop check and rook takes queen wins. And g4 stops f5 because I can just take on f5 first and then take the queen. Mm -hmm. So after g4, now black's lost. King here was the worst move ever. Any other move was better. Any move, even f6 was better. Okay. And every other move was, was in fact, in this position, uh, after queen e5 check, it should be a draw by perpetual. Okay, but after after king here now now white white's white's uh, winning, he played knight e three, bishop e four check, king doesn't really have anywhere to go, because he played king g six, so he plays f five, queen d six check, and it doesn't matter where your king goes. What's funny about this position is once the king moves doesn't matter where. Black has no threat. This looks really daunting, right? Mm -hmm. But the, you, if it was Black's <laughs> move, you can't, you can't do any of that. This, everything stopped. Yeah. So White's going to play Rook B1 and Rook B7 check and mate. He took on F5, which is also good. Rook B1 also wins. Yeah, and then black black has no threat, which is weird because it looks it like looks scary. looks like black has a threat, <laughs> but he does not. Yeah. So he played g4, and that gets mated uh, immediately. If you play king here, then bishop here is mate. Nice mate. And then here he resigned. Um, if you move your king here, which is the only legal move, then I have queen g I have queen g8 mate and queen h6 mate, depending on your preference. So basically, one bad move ruined a big comeback because Maxudlu had a bad position for most of the game. He fought back to an equal or winning position, and then in this position, he played King G6 losing. And man, after G4, if you could see the video of him like choking on his rage, like, oh my God, after G4, he was like, what? You know, Knight G3, they just take it. And you can miss something like that, especially when you're tired from a four and a half hour game. Everybody who plays 2,700, so forth. Yeah. By the way, looking at him, he looks like he's about to retire, but he's actually a kid. <laughs> How old is he? He's like 20, 19. I can't really tell in that picture. Mm-hmm. Oh, that was an interesting game. Yeah, Parham McSudlu about four years ago was world junior champion. Now, I could be wrong, and I probably am, but he might be, or he might not be. I never mind. The, somebody that's like his rating or him or similar was either 
kicked out of Lee Chess or Chess.com, but I forgot which one. And it could be that it wasn't him. However, the chat knows everything. Well, they're talking about semi banned. There's on chess. also banned on Lee Chess. Yeah. Right. Who? who was? Him. Matsublu. Oh. Yeah, I, I knew that either him or somebody like him, like with a similar rating, was on trouble either on Lee Chess or Chess.com. Mm. I forgot which one it was. But yeah, the chat knows all that stuff. Banned on Lee Chess. Yeah. But yet, Magnus will play him. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Shocking. Has no problem play, paying, playing mm -hmm. him. Oh, Cinderov was banned also? Man, tough. He's in the, he's in the challengers group. That's what I'm saying, Pancake Gremlin. 